Hello English learners, welcome to my channel Dr. Meriko Kusi. Today I want to talk about a cover letter or a letter of application. So what is a cover letter? A cover letter is a type of a business letter. It explains why you want the job. A cover letter should complement your CV. The main purpose of a personalized cover letter is to persuade the reader to read your CV and consider you for the vacant position. A cover letter is often your earliest written contact with a potential interview, creating a critical first impression. A well-written, what-focused cover letter demonstrates your written communication skills and will help you to get the position. As all business letters, a cover letter has the following structure, an introduction, a main body, and a concluding paragraph. Great! The components of a cover letter. So, a cover letter includes the contact information of the applicant, which is put on the right side of the paper, the name of the applicant, the current home address, the phone number, and the email besides the date, all in a block style. Note, the recipient and his or her address are put on the left side of the paper. Now, the structure of a cover letter. In the first paragraph, the applicant should detail the position they are applying for and where they have heard or read about it, for example, in a newspaper or on the radio, etc. For example, I am writing in response to your advertisement for the position of or with reference to your advertisement in or I would like to apply for the position of. Great! In the body, the applicant tells and explains why he is the right person to get the position. At this level, he or she is required to mention the different skills and experiences he or she has got by providing evidence. For example, I am currently working as an engineer for the Algerian Ministry of Agriculture. This experience has enabled in understanding the problems of agriculture. In the final paragraph, the applicant should leave a good impression in finishing the letter. For example, I look forward to hearing from you. Good. Now, let's see some formal expressions. Opening. It means in the opening. Of course, you are going to write, dear sir or dear madam. You'd, and you're going to use one of these, for example. I would like to apply for the position of. Or with reference to your advertisement in, of, or I would like to apply for a job in. I am writing in response to your advertisement for the position of. Now in the body, you can write, for example, or you can use these expressions, I feel I'm qualified for the position for I, and you give the, the justification. I feel I have strengthened my knowledge of. At present, I am responsible for. Great. For the final paragraph, I would be happy to give you more details. Or, I look forward to hearing from you. Or, please let me know any details you would require. Please find and enclose the copy of my CV. I enclose a copy of my CV. Yours faithfully. Yours sincerely. Good. Here is... A model letter. Now let's move to practice. The following cover letter is very informal. Rewrite it in a formal way. Select and use the appropriate expressions mentioned above and make any necessary changes. So let me read this letter. Hello. I saw your ad in our local paper last week, so I want to apply for the job of communications assistant. I know I am the person you're looking for. I just got various A-levels from school and all my friends say they love chatting with me. So, write soon and tell me if you want to know more about me. Regards. So, you are required, you are required to rewrite it in a formal way and make any changes. Number two. At this time, I'd like you to write your own cover letter. So imagine and write, write your cover letter. Wish you good luck.
Dr. Melika Kouti.